injured and more on those who died in the shooting. Randall? Rick, those nine people injured during this morning's shooting were rushed here to University Hospital. One died a short time ago. Three have already been released. Three are being treated for non-life-threatening injuries. And two are in critical condition at this hour, including an LMPD officer. And we'll have more on that heroic officer in just a moment. But first, we remember those who died. Among those who lost their lives was 63-year-old Thomas Elliott, senior vice president at Old National Bank in downtown Louisville. He was also a close friend of Kentucky Governor Andy Bashir. Tommy Elliott helped me build my law career, helped me become governor, gave me advice on being a good dad. He's one of the people I talk to most in the world, and very rarely were we talking about my job. To Tommy's family, to the families of Jim Tut, Josh Barrick, Juliana Farmer, Rachel and I join you and families across our entire city and beyond in grieving this shocking and painful loss of your lives. 64-year-old Jim Tut was a market executive at the bank. Tut was a native of Frankfurt and UK grad. 40-year-old Joshua Barrick was a graduate of Louisville's Trinity High School and Cincinnati's Xavier University. Also killed in the attack was 45-year-old bank employee Juliana Farmer, as well as 57-year-old Deanna Eckert. Eight others were injured by the gunman. To the survivors and the families, our entire city is here to wrap our arms around you. 26-year-old Louisville Metro Police rookie Nicholas Wilt is in critical condition. Police said Wilt was one of two officers who were hurt responding to the shooting. Officer Wilt graduated from the police academy just 10 days ago. I just swore him in and his family was there to witness his journey to become a police officer. He was struck in the head, engaged in this incident. Nick has come out of brain surgery and is in critical but stable condition. To Officer Wilt and his family, we will continue to pray and support you. To the other two LMPD officers who were injured, thank you and all of your colleagues for your service Officer Wilt graduated from Oldham County High School in 2016. We can also confirm the fifth victim, Deanna Everett, was a bank employee. The shooting, obviously difficult for Mayor Greenberg at the press conference today, but he did take the time to praise doctors and nurses here at University Hospital and around the country, saying they are true heroes who save lives every day. And we are live at L Hospital downtown. I'm Randall Cam, WLKY News.